Welcome to Kendall Jenner's house, as um, described in the Architectural Digest video. <laughs> Um, so it's huge. It takes up the whole lot on The Sims. So um, there are some things I had to change because I just couldn't get them quite right in the space that I was allowed. But you'll see how I tried to adjust to make it possible. All right. On the outside, she's got this greenhouse, um, which is what I did instead of a driveway because a driveway just doesn't make a whole lot of sense. So we've got this beautiful vivarium instead of a driveway okay um, you'll also see there's this little pathway um, that is for in the video she talks about how her staff has a separate entry into her makeup room and so this is their separate entry which to be honest is um, not something I would love to depict but there we are okay we go in, in the front, past this gate, there's like a little courtyard. Okay, and we'll see kind of how the courtyard connects to the house in a minute. But first, let's go ahead, we're gonna walk on in. Okay, so right through the front entryway we get a view directly into her living room which is supposed to be sunken but i couldn't figure out how to do that so no sunken living room um, but there are arches everywhere really everywhere uh, we've got her dining room off the living room a stairway to the left and that's kind of that's like where her makeup artists and folks would come in and then they go up the stairs into her makeup room and her glam room um, and then this like random nook over here, which has views into the greenhouse. Okay, so here's the living room. In real life, she has kind of the like an enormous vintage record player, which sadly they don't have on The Sims. So that's not showing up. Um, and then a fireplace. Over here, she's got like pop art. And then in this corner is a bar, as well as another nook, and through here is the bathroom. So in real life, she has like a three-ton sink, stone sink, um, which doesn't exist in The Sims either. So this is just like her, I guess, like casual bathroom. And in the video, I also noticed that she has like paper towels right outside the bathroom, which I don't... I don't get it, but there's towels. Okay. Um, so then also off of the main entryway, she has her office. So we'll go in there. Bookshelves literally everywhere with like art and fashion books, a fireplace, some art, and then a desk. Oops, the desk is backwards. Um, and I guess apparently she doesn't work in this office, but okay. And then off of the office, she's got this cute like walkway that goes views into the courtyard. And then we go into her art studio, which used to be a home theater and still kind of is because she has this enormous TV in it. Um, my sim was working on a painting earlier. This is called Me and Bibi, um, and it has a flirty <laughs> level two. <laughs> um, tons of canvases, 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 kind of a slop sink, um, some sketches, and shelves for supplies. Okay, and then so in here is this like secret stairway and it leads into a bedroom and this bedroom you don't see in the video but when I looked it up, this house has five bedrooms and I could only account for three. So I have to devise and fabricate a fifth one and a fourth one, which you'll see later. Um, and so this is kind of like the in-laws apartment, um, which is right above this kind of annex part of the house. Very creative, Lena. Go back downstairs into the art studio. Okay. And then 
back out through this space, which we can hurry it up because. This originally is a James Turrell light piece, but obviously in The Sims they do not have that. So I did this instead, which is like a mirror thing. And from here we can actually move into the main bedroom. Okay, and so her, the like primary bedroom is divided in two and there's this like two-way fireplace as well as a neon light piece above, which um, <laughs> I just did a ton of fluorescent lights instead. And then this corner, oh look, there she is just enjoying a nice cocktail at like five in the morning. Um, and then this is like, a, <laughs> I have no idea what these objects are, tools, um, but in her real house she has like an old Italian door and so instead of that I did something similar which is like a nostalgia corner. Around this wall we've got her bedroom um, and unfortunately they don't have 12 foot beds in The Sims so this is the closest I can get which is a probably normal size bed. Massive TV, let's back out. And then from her bedroom, you can see the yard, so she's a door into the yard. Um, and then the main bathroom through here. And so I've got like this shower inlaid into the wall, which is kind of hideous, but there it is, the little cloud light above it. Um, this bathtub, which is supposed to be gold, um, which is cutely nestled into this nook. Okay, her marble um, countertops, Gabbana marble. And then through here is her closet. Very well lit. Now she actually has two closets because one of them is her actual closet and the other one I guess is a fitting room. Those are different things. Did you know that? Okay, so let's go back out done with the closet we've gone into the bathroom we've gone through the bedroom and now let's go through let's go to the dining room which I'll show you kind of the flow of how this works hi Kendall again boop show up in the living room okay and so from the living room, she's got a dining room, which again, there should be a step up in here, which I just couldn't figure out how to do. Here's the dining room, which looks nuts from this view. Let's see if I can improve this view of the dining room. This is a little better. Here's the dining room with um, layered rugs. Mm. Okay. And then into the kitchen where we have, oops, I didn't mean to do that, our countertops, some green cabinets, copper cookware, a tea set, because apparently she really likes tea, um, and then this is her fridge, and she has a pantry as well. So through here, I feel like all the Kardashians have these like really elaborate pantries that they get professional organizers to set up. So I had to include that. Um, here's her living room. No cloud couches, unfortunately. Uh, there's a the living room, which opens up onto a patio. Look at that. I even got a nice little, uh, I don't know what this is called, the outdoor thing, ceiling thing, um, with steps down into another like patio area. The land rises, takes you to the pool, and then back into her room. Okay, so that's the first floor, which again, it's huge. It took up the whole plot, and so I couldn't add the remaining rooms, which I guess she converted um, the house, or a couple of the bedrooms into, uh, into her glam room and her closet and so I'll work on showing you those now. So let's go over here. Let's kind of fly over the house 
and so you remember this here's our entryway it's the entryway this is the uh, employee entrance she needs for some reason and then go up these stairs that's not a very good cinematic experience let me fix that up the stairs and then if we go up a little more through this door is the gym room which overlooks the driveway I have no idea what this would be but I'm gonna this is like the third bedroom one two three yep and then she's got a guest bathroom here and then around the stair landing which is tricky in the sims she has her glam room, a wall of magazine covers that she's on, and then on the other side of this wall she has her fitting room and a wall of mirrors, as you do. And that is Kendall Jenner's house. Would you look at that? Beautiful.